As the weather starts to cool, there are those who can't wait to lean hard into winter sports. But for those who are dreading the menace of snow, Southern Utah is a great place to enjoy summer fun well into the changing seasons. We are Big Paddle Sports inside of Quail Creek State Park in Hurricane, Utah. This area, it doesn't get as crowded as you think, and so we have a lot of paddleboarders and a lot of kayaking. And so you can rent kayaks and paddleboards from us and enjoy this beautiful lake. It's been nice to be part of the growth of outdoor engagement in Southern Utah, and particularly here at the lake, because essentially everyone that comes out and paddles becomes a friend. Honestly, it's been a privilege to be part of that outdoor recreation draw. There's a lot of history here, and we're a great paddle shop, but we love sharing everything that we, learning everything we can about the area and then sharing all of that good information with other people. And that's one of the ways that we can do it is through our paddle and petroglyph tour that we do, and that's completely unique. We actually found, we found some petroglyphs out here adjacent to the park. There's no drive up access to these petroglyphs. It's been fun to share, it's been meaningful to share. We have tours that just last a couple of hours. If you wanna go out with a guide, we have certified insured license guides to take you out, not only show you how to paddle, we've got some good cliff jumping opportunities. We have lessons. We're really concerned about giving people that skill set that they can walk away with and feel more confident because they're more competent. We have stand-up paddleboard yoga. We have gigantic paddleboards that will take six to eight paddlers. We have water mats that take zero skill whatsoever. We have craft that will fit everyone. There's something here for everybody that's willing to give it a shot. And if you want a break from the water, just a few minutes away from Quail Creek State Park is the Red Cliffs Recreation Area, a cozy campground which affords a glance further back into history. It's just a beautiful area to bring friends and family to. It's one of the ones I always take friends to when they visit. We love going into Red Cliffs with our kids and taking our friends up there because there are a couple of trailheads there which are gorgeous. There's a slot canyon that you can hike into from the campground loop at Red Cliffs, which is spectacular. It's not a challenging slot canyon, but there's also a dinosaur track hike. It takes five minutes, and you're looking at dinosaur track impressions right in the sandstone, in the red sandstone formation. So there's a lot to see up there. The views from, from some of those positions are spectacular. I would say Red Cliffs is it's one of the most underrated hikes in southern Utah. You can feel like you're getting away from the trappings of civilization, which might include large crowds of people. So Red Cliffs, I think, is a perfect fit for that. Quail Creek is a great multi-use lake, which easily accommodates paddlers as well as motorboats. The entire north end of the reservoir is a weight-free zone, so it's perfect for people who love to paddle. I love that I get to be outdoors all the time, all year round and there's always something to do. It doesn't matter what month it is. I teach paddleboard clinics and paddleboard yoga. And so I just love that we can get people to know what they can do outdoors as a family. And that's really what we're all about here. We're not just a rental board company. We want the community to come out, spend time with their family and enjoy the outdoors. Because we love paddling, in the winter time, if somebody wants to go paddle, we'll come out here on a, on a by appointment basis and we'll make sure that somebody has that opportunity to paddle. We're passionate about paddling because of how great it makes us feel and we want to give people every opportunity to have that same feeling, that feeling of engagement, that feeling of decompression, that feeling of rejuvenation. We will find a way to get somebody on the water. The late fall, deep winter, early spring, we'll be here. And if we want to beat the cold, we'll be there too. For this week's Where To, I'm Will Oxley.